Cal Stark 2-2 two two at the plate. What did you see from him? Yeah, I mean, he's he's pretty capable offensively. Ironically, we recruit the guy as a defender first behind the plate where everyone knows defense is so important. Uh, but he's put in a lot of work in the weight room with Q, and um, he's shown he's fully capable with the battles. I'm glad to just get him in the game. And the fact he did well, I think, probably adds to his confidence a little bit. You know, the outfield, you said multiple guys are going to see action this weekend. What did you see from these three tonight? Um, you, you know, I think Jared is such a high-energy kid. He was maybe a little amped up. And then, you know, C. Scott and Booker, too, are so fun to be around as kids because they got big personalities. And that will shine through more as time goes on. Um, but being first time out there, kind of opening day starters, um, you have those emotions running high that make the great personality that you have as a kid. So you just got to learn to direct them in the right way. And I think all three of them played well. But like Dolander, I think all you know three of the outfielders know they can play even better. And there's guys on the bench, too, who are capable of doing some things. And Ensley's one of them who, of course, had that pinch head at bat I was talking about with the third baseman. Now, even though it couldn't play tonight, do you have any comment on the status of that situation? No, I mean, it was a late word for us as far as paperwork, so I can't speak to it intelligently. I just know um, I had to tell the kid, which he was very emotional about, but for the, for the record, the first thing he said to me is, can I still be in the dugout? And uh, it's taken us all a while to get to know him and some of the new faces, but such a lovable kid. And I mentioned the team, I don't think Jasloff plays as well as he does unless he knows the guy next to him in pregame in and out has got his support and a uh, pretty cool story came out of that. Jazzy's an in-state kid that loves the Vols, um, has basically not gotten to do anything other than practice the last two years, no reward, um, and has bided his time. And he certainly worked his butt off to make sure he belongs on a field like tonight. And uh, I don't think anybody could argue he didn't. What do you think about uh, Halverson on the mound for the first time in two years? Kind of Yeah, you, you know, kind of mentioned earlier, just great to get him out there and then for him to do as well as he did was was phenomenal but the fact he kind of settled in if i'm not mistaken um face their best hitter or at least they're the most hyped up hitter it's not my place to say who their best guy is um and got in a groove right away and got a lot of bad swings i think if we play a little better defense he maybe gets through the game and finishes it uh, but maybe gave him a couple more opportunities offensively to wear him down a little bit and, you know, he's only been built up to go four innings for us, and that's about what he did. I know you already answered this, so I'm sorry, but Dolander, he a little high pitch count there at the beginning, but it really settled in. Yeah, no, he got in a rhythm and, you know, truly came to who he was in, in form. And, and part of that is, you know, the expectations are new to this group. Uh, kudos to last year's Vol team and the year before and the year before, uh, but none of them have had to fight some of the battles that these guys have. And some of them are evident to the media and the fans, and there's a few – you know, behind the scenes, uh, but there's new challenges for these guys. And uh, anytime you got a challenge, you can either meet it head on or you can run from it. And and I like our guys. They're starting to form their own personality, their own team image. And if anything, we've gotten a reputation for being a group that'll that'll fight with you a little bit or fight the circumstances. And they need to dig in and do that even more because of that.